Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. We are here with the one, the only Ethan from Lone Oak. <laughs> he, he beat me to it. I was going to say, from where, Ethan? Lone Oak. We were watching the Today Show the other day in here, and uh, they mentioned Al Roker mentioned the temperature in Lone Oak. They did. It was. It was amazing. Uh, Ethan here is a producer, filmographer. I don't, is that a word? Filmographer? Videographer? But it's not video. It's film. Ethan here is a cinematographer and is currently working on a project. Actually, it's a project he's been working on for the better part of a year and a half. Well, it's been an idea floating around. <laughs> and we finally got it into production. The video or the the cinema project is in production now explain to the students what the project is so it's a skate video right it's not like, a skate video it's a, it's a film it's a skate film okay it's called state lines and we just started production well we've been in production for a little bit but we haven't really kicked off or anything but we officially got serious about it and we started it and we have a bunch of stuff we might be able to throw some stuff on screen right now but it's nowhere near finished <laughs> so Maybe sometime around next year after summer at some point. If you end up graduating before this film comes <laughs> out, you're going to have to send it to us whenever it, it gets finished and you're in college. Uh, okay, so uh, it's a skate video. Now, is this uh, video taking place in Arkansas or Mississippi or both? What? So here's the thing. So it's taking place in Arkansas, Mississippi, and Tennessee. You know, the name. Tri-states. State lines. It's taking place in multiple different states. There you go. Beautiful. All right, give us the premise of the film. So there's kind of like a little side story to it about these two kids that just want to make a good skate film. It's mostly a side story type thing. It's mostly going to be skating. But in the background, there will be that story. And there will be some cinematic shots, cinematic story pieces. Okay, now for students who are watching and thinking, oh my gosh, I would love to make a film myself, but I don't have, you know, a million dollars to do it. Explain to the students that with a very small budget, you can actually make a film. What what is the equipment that you're that you're going to be using to do this with? Right now, I'm using for a skate video or anything. You can use pretty much any early 2000s budget camera, and it gives you a pretty good aesthetic. Um, you can find some good cameras on sale, and if you don't think the quality is going to be anything, you can edit it and make it look even better. Y'all hear the word aesthetic? He used the word aesthetic. That's a that was a twenty dollar word. What's aesthetic mean? Look, good look. It good means look. the look, look, the look of the the uh, the film. I, was just I can tell you, you yeah, right. I, I can tell you right now. Um, the the later the later GoPro cameras do a phenomenal job. The Hero Nine, the Hero Ten. Uh, there's also what what's the camera you're gonna buy? You said you were you were looking at getting. Yeah, I have that one. I just got it. Oh, what what is it? Uh, it's the Panasonic G85. It's on sale right now. Okay, so uh, there are tons of really great cameras that you can use and your phones are also incredible cameras you get a little bit of software either free software or some paid software and you can make a film you can do it state lines we're looking forward to seeing the film if you are interested in making your own film and you don't know what to do come find ethan he'll talk you through it